Hello everyone, welcome back to our video tutorial. No? Uh, first of all, I would like to thank Ria Jinon Umagay for her concern. Nag-tension ako sa Facebook, ni Ana siya nga. Oh, ang among topic is the difference. Medyo galibog siya sa difference between IDE and programming language. So this video is a special video. Dili ni siya continuation sa tuwang C++ nga programming language but we will try to understand better understanding in terms of IDE and the programming language. We need in order to start creating a program, in order to programming, in order to create programs. No, one is IDE, which is Integrated Development Environment. IDE is basically our environment. Second one is our programming language. No, and sa previous na tong video tutorial is C++ na programming language. For this video, we are going to tackle another programming language, no? The easy ones. But first, we have to understand IDE. Okay, so we are going to search Integrated Development Environment, okay? So IDE, or Integrated Development Environment. Definition sa IDE. This one is a software application that provides facilities, comprehensive facilities. Uh, this idea is intended for computer programmers. What are computer programmers? Those are people who create a program. They create sila og software. No? For software development. Dira ang kanya idea, dira ta mo sulat sa to ang mga programming, sa to ang mga lines of codes. Pinaka basic, dira ta mo sulat sa to ang mga lines of codes and then dira ta mo compile, dira na to tibuk on para mahimo siya piece of program or software. I-build na yun nato siya, dira na to siya i-execute. Siya mo tibuok sa to ang mga ginahimo. That is IDE. So hopefully, medyo kasabot na no. Okay, so we will look for an examples of IDE or Integrated Development Environment. Uh, examples. Examples. Okay, top IDE. Top 50. No? It's because dili man lang gawin yung code blocks or ang ato ang isa kay IDE. Daghan dun sila. So, we have uh, Ah, okay. We have the example of IDE is Android Studio. This one, this IDE, tanig define. The official IDE for Android Studio provides the fastest tool for building applications all types of Android devices. Okay? So, this is an example of IDE. This IDE is intended for Android devices. So, this IDE, dire ka makaraid ka o mga program kung ganaan ka muhimo o mga Android application. This Android Studio. So, if you want to study uh, mobile applications, you can use Android Studio. Highly recommended 5 star. Another 5 star. But before you proceed, kindly master the fundamentals of programming. Kinaaya po na siya dito. Okay? So, we have features. It has intelligent code editor. This one. Okay? That is another example of IDE, the Android Studio. We have the App Builder. Ang ito na lahat, no? Intended for mobile applications. We are going to proceed. Proceed ta sa itong ginatawag na programming language. Next one is the programming language. Programming language. Naka ni definition. Ay, dito ko magbasi. Di ay sa tuang Google Classroom. Okay, ara. Programming language is a vocabulary and set of grammatical rules for instructing a computer or computing device to perform a specific task. A set of grammatical rules, it has its own rules para basahon dito sa computer. Programming languages are intended for computers. Ragan siya. 
And then nakalain lang, ini siya examples of programming languages are Java, JavaScript, PHP, C, C Sharp, and C++. So sa akong example na to, eh, try na to ni siya og tackle kung unsa na siya para sa asa na siya, di ba? First one is Java. Google Java. No. Java is different from JavaScript. Java programming language. Ara. Okay. Okay, ara. Java it is a general purpose programming language intended to let application developers write once run anywhere. So, applicable siya meaning that Java meaning meaning that compiled Java code can run all the platforms that support Java without the need of the compilation. It is intended for application developers. So, Java is for application. Not only desktop application, but also mobile application na siya Java. Okay? So, we'll proceed to another programming language. We have the PHP. Salangan na itong usap para madali ito. Tagsatagsaw na itong medyo bugay. Kaya gani siya, understanding, rin siya better understanding of programming language. PHP programming language. Dili ni siya Philippine Piso, di ba? Philippine Piso is also a PHP. But sa ato, <laughs> dili sa ato ang uh, um, computer related nga course, ang PHP is a programming language. So PHP, Recursive acronym for Hypertext Preprocessor. It is widely used. General purpose of this programming language is suited for web development. So, kung gaay na ang Java, guys, is intended for mobile applications or desktop applications intended for applications, this one is intended for web development and can be embed into HTML. So, HTML is another programming language, okay? So, another summary, another examples of programming language is PHP and this one is Murait Kau Code intended for web development. Website, baka ng Facebook, Google, YouTube, those are sites na for good. Sa karo, na-improve lang na na po yung application na sa inyo, sa inyo phone. Pero ang base yun na nila, ang ilang server na they are using a website yun. Okay na. So, um, more examples. Dili na lang. Dili na lang. Or, no? We will proceed and trying a another programming language. So, mag-web development gorota, no? We will use another um, programming language which is uh, this one. Kanisa itong ginatawag na HTML, yung programming language. So, define na to. for the definitions Wikipedia credits na siya ha? so HTML or hypertext markup language is another programming language this one is a standard designed to be displayed in a web browser so it is intended for web application uh, websites no web browser pero only for design a uh, display display meaning Kung ano siya? Interface. Naong rin siya ba? Naong. No? So, we will try HTML. We are going to use the same IDE, which is the code blocks. Code blocks. Okay, so this is code blocks. Nanani siya sa previous na itong video. And sa previous na itong video, we created a a file that is intended for C++ nga programming language but this time would be different we are going to use another programming language which is ang HTML so we need a file extension that is intended for HTML okay so file new empty file so when we say empty file wala pa ni siya ma-identify yun sa siya nga klase nga file that's because this one is empty wala pa siya file extension we are going to determine uh, we are going to name this file 
para ma-identify siya. File, save file as. Ano itong gibot? Last time. Sa previous video. This time, we are going to use another programming language which is an HTML. Um, this IT first year. Okay? That So, kung ang C++ guys is .c50, the result ang uh, HTML is .html also. HTML. BSIT first year .html. Okay? Yan. Okay. So, we created a... Nani siya diri? Ano? BSIT first year. May properties na ron, ha? Ano? Type of file. HTML document. Okay, na-identify siya. Kaka na siya is HTML. So, we are going to try another programming language. So, uh, maon na ay lain-lain nga features ang programming language is because they have their own set of grammatical rules. Kung sa C++ na nato is we, we created a code na C out or C out and then symbol diri sa HTML it has its own features na masayon ko para sa uban for example the printing out or the output the printing out of hello world okay so wala ko lang buhaton all i have to do is to type hello world then i save na ko na siya kuna i open na ko siya we cannot build Dili na to ni siya ma-build and run, ha? Nga naman. Because we are not creating computer programs. We are creating a website. So, dapat dito po na to, dito po tamo paran sa browser, internet browser. Kay website, may itong gihimo. Di ba kato gayin na computer programs? Ah, kato la, katang last video na to, nga tutorial, those are intended for computer programs. So, ato ang gipa-build and run siya, sa computer program siya nga side na bilaw pero this one is intended for websites so ato ang kaon is enter browser okay mao na ni siya ang ako ang file this one is the file so kung i-open ako na siya ang katong hello world na itong detail gayon na tada bugawas okay so ang, ang naka default is internet explorer but it can also be browsed by another browser as long as that is a browser internet browser so for example ang ako ang uh, opera uh, i'm using um, opera browser desktop sa file name ito base it first year base it ara So, pag-open ako siya, magawas ang Hello World. So, for those mobile applications na wala students, for those students na wala laptop or desktop, uh, you can still create a program that is intended for HTML programming language or website using a mobile application na nana siya karoon, no? Wala na, the, uh, the programmers are looking for a way na uh, dili limitado ang ma-access dito sa tuwang mobile application kay almost ila nang gi gisoon tanan nga computer pero lagi disadvantage and dinapoy napoy disadvantage ang mobile application since sa computer na po advantage na po disadvantage no adapt lang ta kung sa naa so another example is our my google chrome so kun yo pina ko siya bitaw na ko yes i think first year na at pa mugaw sa atong hinimo na ko hello world Okay, now this time we are going to configure our hello world. So my name is BSIT. Paubos na ako. Dayon, may ngon kung uh, I am 21 years old. I am from San Carlos City. Kanala, tolo lang sa. So I save. Uh, file, save Save file Then, naka-open na lang siya Diri nga bro So all I need to do is I'm going to refresh this one 
right click, refresh, wala yung refresh. So, F5 for shortcut sa refresh. Meaning, ang ako ang giriran, ang ako ang browser. So, my name is BSIT. I am 21 years old. I am from San Carlos City. Okay, nigawa siya, no? Pero wala siya, wala siya ng obos. Okay? The, um, we will add some adit additional code na po. Same na po na ito, ng dungag tag backslash n, ng dungag taog end line, pero diri sa pro, HTML nga programming language is different. Diri mo dungag taog break. Break. So, save na ako. Rira na ako. And we have the my name is Bess IT. I am 21 years old. I am from San Carlos City. Now, welcome to another programming language. Na namoy duha. Guys, na namoy duha ka programming language. Na namoy duha ka programming language. Which is, ang one is a C++. And second one is ang HTML. Now, I want you to study further. If you want to develop websites, now, diri mo magtoon sa HTML and then PHP. Okay, so, further, last, last na ko yung example para mainggan nyo mo. But, uh, once again, before you proceed to another programming language, make sure that you are familiar or na master ni mo ang itong ginatawag na fundamentals of programming language. So, this one, we are going to create a login form. Uh, username. If you are familiar with any applications, any websites na siya login form, that is required. Username and password. Tanawa na to. Kung kaya ba na to. Username, input type. Name. Okay, input type name mo niya submit. So, save. Nang tao na to kung kasi may tabo niya, no? We have, we created a, we created a series of instructions. May padagan ako dito sa computer. We have this one, username. Oh, my bad. Password na din siya. So, we have username. Sulat ka. Tangan to break the ready para sada username then password and then submit na button so mo ingon nabi ko nga my username is base i think my password is password is supposed to be ano no supposed to be tong dot nga ito pero word makita siya sa yung siya uh, input type name my bad IT and then password. Okay? So that um, every programming language has its own grammatical rules. Pero English na siya ta ng Japan na wala yung isang yan. No? Wala pa yung Tagalog. Or, pero kung kaya ninyo, no, hibuin ninyo. Okay? So pariyar na sila. It's, a, it's just nga some um, programming language is intended for websites. For example, lang like HTML nga itong gigitakol ka ron. And some programming language is intended for computer programs nga ito ang ginatakol sa previous na video. And some programming language is intended for mobile applications. Daghan kayo na siya. Okay? But first, before you proceed, I want you to master the fundamentals of programming. I will keep you busy. So good next week. There should be an activity every week para ma-feel po yung asadyante mo, di ba? Every problem has a solution. The process takes time. Kaya ni Nino, believe me ko ninyo. See you in the next video.